All right, I'm gonna start with Hosi again. And Grom, you haven't played this game much before, isn't that right? Uh, I checked how many hours I had on Steam before mm -hmm. accidentally leaving it on for a couple hours while I was setting it up earlier, and I had mm -hmm. four hours total. Okay, yes. Most of which so. was probably in menus of some sort. <laughs> so, all right, yeah, well, this I, will I be know shit all, and it is funny as well, because I booted up the thing to join the game, and the first thing it said to me was, Wow, you look pretty fresh. Maybe you should do the tutorial. And I said, no. <laughs> oh, you got called I was, out. I, I said, no, I already have a tutorial. Her name is Crocker. <laughs> oh, all right. So it's once it. I load in, you should be able to join on me. So right now it's going to be booting up all the different things, making stuff, all that. Oh, no, the server is not responding. Oh, no, the server is dead. I'm, I'm just being a dick. Oh, okay, well, that makes sense. I should have expected that. That's really on me. Really on me for not expecting that. <laughs> Izzy, why do I suddenly want to cuddle Graka? <laughs> that is a good question. I don't know. I just, what do you think, Grom? I, did you ever have, like, an orcish cuddle puddle? Is that a thing that happens? I didn't really grow up around many other orcs, so... Eh, I mean, wrestling matches? <laughs> Probably about the closest you get. And that's basically what cuddling is, right? It's cuddling with violence. That's totally exactly how orcs cuddle. Where do you think are the ghosts of people who become zombies go? Do they get to pass on? Are they stuck following the zombie? I mean, do you think that the zombies still have their souls in them is the real question there. All right, Grom, what do you think? Do zombies have souls? If there's such a thing as a uh, ghost of a zombie. Uh, I think that when it comes to zombies, they very likely do have souls. Though, then again, I would also say I am not the best authority on souls, for I am a ginger. That is fair. Well, no, you're great at the word in souls in that case. Don't you collect them? It's like Pokemon to you people. I, I, as for what my stream mentioned before, I guess I'm two souls in debt. Two souls in debt to who? You would control to be able to fight shit, right? Thanks. Oh, what was that? Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! No, 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 no! No, 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 I was just left this house! Get the bloody hell away from me! You absolute degenerate fucks! Well, I see that uh you have met the neighbors. Uh equip the spoon as a primary weapon. Might recommend something with a little more, uh... Well, hammer. that's all I got before they came in! <laughs> I can't be super picky choosy about this right now, I can't! Oh, oh, man. M turns the music on and on and does not open up a map. I have now learned <laughs> this. There is... yeah, no, there is... Wait, there is no map. Wait, 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 it. wait, wait. Why does this spoon look like a knife? That literally... that's literally just a model of a knife. They didn't even bother. Shh. Early access game? Early access game. Early oh access my god, there's so many zombies. Access. It's been an early access for so bloody long. <laughs> you can at least model a bloody spoon. I want to murder shit with a spoon. <laughs> Let's see, I thought. Come on, come on. Is there oh. is there a button to like walk super stealthily? Uh, I'm trying to remember if there is control. 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 Oh Controls out to the combat thing. All right. <laughs> I love how you have no comment for that. <laughs> I have. I honestly, I've got like ten zombies or more, more than ten zombies just in a line behind me as I'm walking through trying to find you. So uh... I'm just <laughs> in some neighborhood trying to find a house that isn't already overrun by zombies, so I can loot it for some nice shit. I mean... Because I am literally is... currently, uh, you know... I, I also love how I, uh, am gray-haired, despite apparently only being 27. <laughs> oh, but, man. Uh, you know, the zombie apocalypse, like that's a lot of stress. Head. I can understand it. Yeah, having to carry the weight of this team on my back. Uh, is there a way to climb fences or no? Yes. You have to approach it, and then I think is it space or E or something? There is a way to climb over them. 
That's why I can I can tell oh, you for e. sure. Yes, it's E. It's E. It's E. There we go. It's got to re-edit to make it over. I just did, I just did the process of elimination, as people might call it. Uh -huh. I look at everything you mentioned, and therefore eventually got it. What are you? Some kind of fucking lot. scientist? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, I have a degree in smut. A degree in smart or a degree in smut? Because those are two different things. A uh, uh, smart. Don't you dare take my accent as a way to mis <laughs> misinterpret myself in the loo. Okay? Uh -huh. well, yeah, I may not be wholly say so, but I'm also simultaneously. Why is there a zombie here with two bottles of bleach on top of it? Uh, is it actually a zombie? Because it sounds like someone decided they didn't want to continue in the apocalypse. Yeah. That is it's, called it's a, a player two quit the game. Two, it's a corpse with uh, empty bleach bottles on top of it. Oh, yeah. it's definitely someone who sighed no more. And uh, Tantral, of course, orcs do science. Why would you even say that? We are the yeah, we do science with two Ks. No, Ooh, no uh, I, I have a new weapon. I have upgraded from a uh -huh. spoon to a butter knife. Man, getting real fancy over there. There we go, right. space bar now. There's someone who uh, really fast. I'm gonna rip up whoever this is his underwear. That yeah, seems like a thing to do. It's not like they're using it. And below knees. I think that's some kind of yeah. elf thing. You should probably leave that behind. It's probably poisonous. Uh, you canned knees nuts. Uh, <laughs> I have made what the cool kids call the internet they make joke. Alright, so let's see. Tantal asks, as a concept, which do you like more? Undead walking corpse zombies or still alive just insane zombies? All right, so the difference between the old school type of zombies and the quote unquote infected. Yeah, I mean, the infected are definitely uh, a lot scarier to me. I find, uh, honestly, like the infected have a lot more use for cool designs and whatnot, and they can get pretty interesting, in my opinion. But oh, yeah. by the same token, I actually do prefer the classic style of zombie. Because their menace is not in them sprinting at you, it's that you can never get rid of them. Like, the, oh. the infected zombie idea is mostly that they are, you know, it's unable to be stopped. Mm -hmm. Like, they will not bloody stop. And that in itself is really uh, it's scary. It is also uh, the... Like, I'm, I'm multitasking. I'm getting so fucking such. So I'm, I'm trying to cook a button chop, okay? I know, I know. Doing two things at once is very, very difficult. I like the idea of uh, shambling, walking corpse zombies because they are relentless, and unlike the infected kind of zombies, in most circumstances, if you have an infected zombie and you shoot it in the places that would kill a normal human, they will still die. Well, that but, also depends on the kind of infection. Like, parasitic infection has always been very interesting to me in that way. Oh, you're talking about, like, Last of Us style? Yeah, like, Left 4 Dead, that kind of style. Go ahead. I mean, Left 4 Dead I can definitely get, yeah. I mean, it, <laughs> it has a lot more of a cooler design, but I just like the dread from... The idea of dread from the regular, uh... Shambling corpse types, personally. I guess I I'm, I'm sort of, I'm sort of done on my point there. I don't have anything else to add. <laughs> it's mutton chop bloody cook already. I will I will be honest. There is one thing that did sort of a uh, like the game itself looks fun, but the whole entire thing uh, pisses me off a good amount. World War Z oh, because yeah, that is yeah. based on a Max Brooks book. Yeah, yeah, I know what you're talking about. And Max about. Brooks. Literally wrote, wrote the zombie survival guide, which is the survival guide for how to deal with the shambling corpse kind of zombie, not the infected kind of zombie. And they turned them into running infected zombies in the video game in the movie. That pisses me off a little bit. Definitely not true to uh, true to the source material. It's I can definitely not tr definitely not true to the source material whatsoever. But uh, we just saw a deal. I humbly invite all zombies to do a pleasant fuck off. <laughs> I don't think I like lurking here anymore. Oh, yeah, I really, I'll be I'll be quite honest. I'm gonna agree with Pippi there. I don't think I like working here anymore. And I don't even work <laughs> here, I'm unemployed. <sighs> but you know, my co-workers are awful people. I mean look at them, they keep moaning at me. Just wine, wine, wine all day with these guys. Yeah. Super hard! Share this with your-
friends too! And watch some other videos as well! Bye bye <laughs>